Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This video is a long time coming and it's actually in collaboration with one of my pen pals. Her name is Sunny Rani. She is a really talented journalist who, as you can see in these beautiful spreads that she produces, and there's a lot of tutorials in her channel as well, so please check her out, especially if you are Indonesian. So a few weeks ago, I went on a trip to get away from university life. I thought it would be interesting to illustrate my getaway trip into a journal spread and I'll, throughout this video I will also be showing some clips of, that I took during my trip so that it will feel as if you were there with me. So as a super last minute person, um, we actually planned this trip properly the night before. So we found out that there was a lot of people that could possibly be cheated if they went for the taxi option. So it was a good thing that we checked out TripAdvisor and went for the bus option instead, which was actually 10 times cheaper. And then the first thing that we did was check out the strawberry and lavender fields. There were also some other really really beautiful flowers there as you can see in these clips. It was really nice to be in the mountains because the weather was so cooling. Where I am from, it is usually very humid and hot. So the cooling weather really amplified the calmness. After that, as we walked, there was also a strawberry farm. But unfortunately on that day, the strawberry farm was open for plucking, which is unfortunate. But aside from that, we also got to try out some wild honey, which was actually really good. There is definitely a difference between store-bought honey and wild-grown honey. That artificial sugary taste is just not there, which is a good thing. And also another highlight of the trip was we got to try this strawberry ice cream. Hopefully, I didn't ask them, but hopefully this was actually made with fresh strawberries. After we were done with the strawberry fields, we went up to the shopping center. We basically, we were in awe with the amusement park called Sky Tropolis. This indoor theme park had so many rides. There's even a ferris wheel inside. There's even a ride whereby the boat just goes around Sky Tropolis to show what it looks like and it's just really, really beautiful. As you can see from my twirling, I was really excited. After a whole day of traveling, we were famished and decided to have our lunch at this place called The Laughing Fish. It was a British pub that is known to serve the best fish and chips. I had the haddock version and I personally prefer the 
light and fluffy type of fish and chips. This one was too fishy. All in all, the environment was really nice and the fish and chips kept me full throughout the day. And I saved the best for last and the most memorable part of the trip was the cable car ride. So in order to go to the shopping mall, we actually had to use a 15 minute cable car ride and I wouldn't have it any other way because the view is just amazing. So at first when we were on our way to the shopping mall, it was raining, that's why we couldn't see anything. So we went for the better experience and decided to get a sky glass floor cable car so that we could look at the view below our feet. It was really terrifying for someone who has a slight fear of heights. But the best view was when the rain cleared and the clouds cleared and we were able to see the mountainous view with the clouds just like floating on top of the mountains and the buildings and the temple. All in all, this getaway was much needed and well deserved. Hope this video was enjoyable and relaxing and also a reminder to you to take a break and just enjoy what nature has to give. If you've watched till the end of the video then please consider giving this video a thumbs up so that it lets me know that you enjoyed this type of content. Also subscribe for more art, tips and student related videos in the future. I hope that you'll have a lovely day and I'll see you in the next video.